I want to go over the latest results for the 50K portfolio coming in today in a $925 drawdown. We end the day down 100 on the day. So minus 100 on the day, roughly. And we were um, down about minus 2200 on the day. So we were, our, the intraday drawdown for this portfolio was minus 3100 intraday because we started with minus 900 and we went down. Um, Esther Countryn 4 was minus 825. Esther Countryn 2 crude oil. These are the crude oil strategies were minus 825. And then Cobra 3 meaning NASDAQ lost on a short trade. This one was at an equity peak yesterday. So this is the first losing trade after an equity peak. And you see trades like this. Those are on previous days. These red vertical lines represent the previous days. And so the trade on the day, though, was the gap continuation in reverse that brought us back. Plus 1975 on this trade. Really nice trade. And the e mini s and kind of cringed when this trade went off after we were already down 2200 Wasn't my favorite trade. I thought the market was going to roll over, but uh, we traded the signal anyways. And so our emotions aren't always the best indicator of how a strategy, uh, which which trading system signals we should take. Um, and soybeans is, is the, is, uh, has an open position on the day, plus 250 on on this open position that we are holding in this overnight. We don't always hold positions overnight, but soybean swing is. And so all of the trades are flat right now. There's about an hour and 25 minutes until the stock market closes. So it's possible that Cobra CT3, I don't think it'll trade. Uh, VIX is too high. But none of these other strategies should trade. I don't think we'll get any more trades today in the 50K portfolio. Any of the day, minus 100. And just wanted to share with you what the latest results are. Um, if we look at the 50K portfolio right here at the uh, monthly results, um, like I said, we're minus 925. We're 12, up 1295 on the month. It had a good September recovering from a drawdown. It had this drawdown in September around 7,500, and it came back. Now it's pulled back to about minus 1,000. So I always recommend start waiting for a 3 to 5K drawdown. Sometimes you can get that intraday. Today was one of those days where had you been trading this, you could have started intraday and jumped on this trade when we were in a 3K drawdown and um, ended up on the day starting in a drawdown like that and then jumping on that. So those are the latest results for the 50K portfolio. It was a wild day. I want to talk about the market internals as well. I'll do the All Strategy Exits video uh, later on, but I'm doing this right now at about uh, 135 Eastern or Central Time, 235 Eastern, to um, because we're done with the 50K for the day, and those are the main trading system signals. But if you look at how choppy this market was, it traded down uh, in the 14400 area NASDAQ overnight. Massive rally at the open, even though the market internals were weak. And then it rallied. It took out the lows of the day, and then it rallied again. And then it had a Fibonacci retracement right here. I don't normally watch fibs, but I watched that. And then we had the um, the news flow out of D.C. was that there would be resolution. resolution. They made it sound like there would be resolution for the debt ceiling, talking about the uh, the consequences of not raising the debt ceiling and there's some politics, and it made it sound like um, there would the, the likelihood that they would raise the debt ceiling uh, would be a higher, higher percentage. So the market has rallied since that point, but the, there's no final resolution yet. So we shall see. The, the bulls were surprised when the market was down here. They, they assumed the market would rally some more from here overnight, and it took out the uh, intraday lows overnight, which I thought was weak. And I thought we'd be down today, and we still could. This market still could roll over. I don't know what it's going to do, really. It could rally. It, it could roll over. We're just trading our signals, and these are the latest trades on the day um, for the 50K portfolio.